Chels here and I thought it'd be fun today to do the fall tag that's kind of been like going around. I saw it on a couple people's YouTubes like I'm not I don't have a huge following or anything but I thought it would be kind of fun to just do it and um, you guys whoever's watching this can get to know a little bit about my fall obsessions and things that I love. I also have picked up a couple things for the fall season slash going into winter which obviously involves turtlenecks, sweaters, and nail polish and all that girly stuff. So I guess we can like get right into it and I'm gonna start with the tag. Then I'll show you a little bit of some stuff that I have picked up. So I have it on my phone. All right, the favorite tag. Favorite candle. Um, I actually just picked up a candle from Bath and Body Works, go figure. Like, I'm pretty sure that's the only place to ever buy candles. You can't like walk into that store and not come out with something. So I just bought, oh, where is it? I had it. Oh, it's right here. So this is going to be part of what I picked up as well. So it's the autumn candle. And I know like everyone's obsessed with leaves. Don't get me wrong. That candle is amazing. And I also have it in my car, like the, the scent thingies. So like I have that scent already. So I figured why not pick up a candle that had like a little something different and not the same as everyone else, even though. I guess I have it in my car, so I'm still jumping on the leaves bandwagon, but whatever. This one smells really good. This candle just reminds me of like walking the dog outside in like a crisp day where you're kind of cold, but like since you're walking and outside you're warm and you're holding like an apple cider or something. Wow, this like really got all that from a candle. Okay, favorite lip color. Oh my god. That is way too hard, like, there's too many to choose from. But, okay, I have this one in my hand because maybe it's like my favorite color right now. I just picked it up a little while ago. I think I wore it in one of my videos. It's purple. It's like Revlon. I picked it up for $3.99 when shoppers had like this massive sale. Question numero three. Favorite drink um, for fall? Okay, I'm gonna sound like such a stereotypical white girl, but obviously it's a Starbucks drink. Or uh, Starbucks or Tim's. Okay, well if I'm going to Tim's in the morning before work, peppermint tea with two milk, one sugar. If I need a caffeine boost, I'll go to Starbucks. I get the, oh my god, I can like literally just my order. I always get a grande skinny cinnamon dolce latte with an extra shot of espresso if I need that extra perk up in the morning, which Normally I do because I get up at like six. Okay, question four. Favorite blush. Okay, I don't have a favorite blush. Um, I kind of just use, like I have one main one. Uh, it's a Buxom blush. It came in like a palette, which if you guys have seen any of my other videos, like I use all the time. It has like a bronzer, a blush, a luminizer, or a highlighter. And um, it's like a pinky and I use it all the time. Like, that's just kind of my go-to. I don't really think I have, like, a favorite that I'm always using. So I would have to say that the Buxom blush, it's like a light pale pink. It looks good on me. I'm like, why go spend the money? I'd rather buy, like, a new eyeshadow or something fun. Favorite clothing item. Oh, oh that is hard. I don't know. Let me see. Okay, well, this kind of goes into some new stuff I bought. I have recently got like a sweater. Here, I'll show you guys. Okay, it's really cute and it's like a turtleneck, but like sleeveless and it's long. Like you can wear it over jeans or like leather leggings. It looks really good and I just really like it. I've worn it and I've gotten so many compliments on it. I got it at Forever 21 for $34, $36, I don't know, but like it, to me, I don't know if anyone's seen the Aritzia version of this, but it looks almost the same. It doesn't have zippers here, but it does have like the, like the fabric cuts, I guess, and it's a turtleneck and it's got cut off sleeves in it. Honestly, they look so similar and that's like... I want to say over a hundred or a hundred or over a hundred and this was 36 and I've gotten just as many compliments on it. Favorite fall movie, uh, favorite fall movie, favorite fall movie. I don't really, okay, I'm not a big movie person. Like, I don't really like movies, like maybe a scary movie. 
um, like Halloween or like the, um, I used to really like the Halloween Town movies, um, but you know, uh, Disney when they used to play those were sweet, which I think they still play sometimes, I don't really know, but yeah, it's a hard one. I don't really have like a favorite fall movie. Favorite fall TV show, okay, that, see I'm a TV person, like movies, eh, TV, I have too many shows to count. Right now, for fall, starting up, it just started, it's called The Blind Spot. Holy crap, you guys, this show is like edge of your seat. You just have to keep watching. Like I've gotten, well, mostly everyone I've told about it, I've gotten them hooked. Like my mom is a huge Blacklist fan and um, like those kind of FBI like takedown shows and I am too, I love The Blacklist. This show is just like, it keeps you guessing. Like you have no idea what's gonna happen. Uh, favorite Thanksgiving food. Okay, so this is kind of weird. My family does, it's like we created our own tradition. It's just my mom, my dad, and I. Like, I don't have any siblings. And we created this, like, weird tradition. My mom is a huge cook, but she kind of, like, makes her own Chinese food. And so anyways, she makes, like, her own chicken balls. She has her own deep fryer. Um which you wouldn't know because she's literally like this big. <laughs> um, so she has her own deep fryers, which she makes her own chicken balls, egg rolls. It's like all homemade from scratch. She does um, her own like this rib recipe that is to die for and like chow mein and just like all these different dishes that you get like at a Chinese food restaurant and we do that for our Thanksgiving. So that's kind of what we do. So I guess like it's not your traditional thing, but my mom's chicken balls are really, really good. So I bet you're not going to hear that. And you're like, what's your favorite Thanksgiving dinner or like meal? Oh yeah, chicken balls. <laughs> and favorite Halloween costume. I had a crazy love for Greece when I was younger and I was Sandra D. And I loved that costume. I need some office clothes since I work in an office. So I picked up this really cute skirt from Banana Republic. You guys don't need to see what size I am. Just let me take that off. So it's like a, it's actually very complimentary on, complimentary, is that the right word? I think it is. Um, because it's got this like side zipper. I don't know, it just, it's very, I'm not a huge, like, I don't like things that are tight. I'm not, um, I like baggy. I like a line. I just don't like tight. It just makes me feel uncomfortable. This is tight, but it's very, it's very complimentary. It looks nice on and it's wool. So it's a good solid skirt for the workplace. And I got it 20% off. It was still kind of pricey, but like it will last me. You know, if you're buying quality pieces, they're going to last if you're going to spend the money on them. Unless you're like, okay with sometimes like for a season, like I'll buy a couple pieces that are on the cheaper end and then you know that by next season they're probably not going to last, but that's okay because you can go out and there will be new styles and new stuff. But if you want some like basics that you know you'll have in your closet for a long time, then Banana Republic's a great store to go to. There are plenty, you know, but I like this one because they always, always have deals. So I got this. To go with this skirt, I got... Sorry that I'm like cutting over here, but this is where I have all my clothes. It's like a crop top, if I can grab it. So it's a crop top to go with the skirt. It's just black, it's cute. It has like a little zipper on the back and I also got that at Banana Republic. So I like it. I think the whole outfit itself is adorable. And I think I got this 20% off too. It was marked down, I think. I don't have the receipt with me. I went to the mall yesterday with my mom to go exchange some boots and she owed me 50 bucks, so instead of paying back the 50 bucks, she just bought me a new shirt from Aritzia, and it's just like a plain white basic. It's like, it's not a crop top, but it's still a little short. It looks really cute with jeans. Um, I wore it last night with leggings and like a cardigan, and it's just white, which I'm a little worrisome because I have this innate ability to just spill food on everything. Like, I don't know how it's possible that one person can spill that this much food on their wardrobe. I was at work a little while ago eating chocolate pudding, okay? 20 minutes later, I, like, reach 
to go near my keyboard, like the pullout thingy. And I'm like, why is that chocolate pudding everywhere? I was like, how did I sit at my desk for 20 minutes, I kid you not, and not realize that I had pudding all over myself. I look down and there's like chocolate pudding on my dress, on my cardigan. It's like, am I in another world? Probably didn't have a coffee that morning. I'm gonna go with that. It's embarrassing. So those are my fall, a couple fall things that I bought for the season and the fall tag all in one video. I also have a subscription box review coming up. I just, I have to go out. I might come back and film that tonight, so I don't know. But stay tuned because I will have that uploaded after this one um, and we'll see. And I'll see you guys in my next video. So take care and have a great week ahead. I know it's Sunday, at least by the time I'm, I'm filming this on a Sunday. I don't know when I'll have it uploaded, but when you see it, I hope you all have a great week and I'll see you in my next video. Don't forget to subscribe, hit that button so that we can get some more subscribers, get some more views and comment below. Love to hear from you guys. I love like, I love talking to you guys and I love watching other people's YouTube videos. So if you want me to check out your channel as well, just comment below and I'd love to take a look. It's so fun seeing everyone else's fall tags and fall videos. I love, you know, getting ideas and inspiration from my own wardrobe and just some things that uh, I may not know are out there. So I'll see you guys later. Bye.